Hello everyone. Um, I would like to welcome you to this video where I'm going to be talking to you about our Overland camper shells that we put on our military trucks. And I've been doing a lot of research for the past two months trying to get this uh, buttoned up to get us the most affordable and the most convenient uh, shells that we need for our military vehicles. Because if I want to show you really quick, as you can see right here, look at all these Overland Expedition trucks. Um, I What's funny is they don't even tell you the pricing. You have to call the brokers to actually get an idea on the cost of these trucks. Um, a good deal of these are anywhere from half a million dollars to $1.4 million for these trucks. They are not cheap and most of them come out of Europe. So it's harder to get trucks like this in the United States. There are other companies um, such as Earth Roamers and a couple other uh, companies in the United States that also make expedition vehicles. But again, they're charging well over half a million to over a million dollars, which doesn't make it very convenient for us to afford something like that. Because many of us uh, are just simple families that want to go have fun out in the great outdoors with our families. And we don't want just a simple RV that is not completely capable of going off-roading. We want a truck that can actually go anywhere. So I finally have um, buttoned up what I want to do for my campers. So if you go on my website here to stealthdevelopers.com and you scroll down, I have a new section, which is the Overland Truck Campers. Now, this has already been on my catalog if you've seen the campers, but I was just toying around putting that on our catalog saying that we can't offer it with our composite panel system. I'm really trying hard to do a fiberglass shell, but it's taken a lot longer than I expected and it's gonna cost a lot more money than I expected. And many of you are getting anxious where you do want to get something like this and still save money. So I'm gonna show you what I, what I got available that you can get right now today i can get you this camper today so basically uh it's just a simple um uh box that they're going to be building uh, with a slight curve in the front and this will be completely finished where uh you don't even have to have the truck included with this i don't even have the truck included with my pricing but i'm going to be having these shells manufactured with a full kitchen bath and everything completely done and then what we'll do is we'll mount it to the back of your truck so this is what the shell looks like is just this simple camper shell that we have so basically it's almost like a regular camper but you just don't have the wheels attached or the frame attached underneath and then uh, what we'll do is we can either make a, a longer one or uh, just keep it standard 16 or 20 feet and we'll mount it to the back of a truck like this is an fmtv military truck that has an extended frame in the back where they were able to uh, mount this as well and we can do custom interior finishes but it will cost more i say stick to the basics if you want a basic shell uh, these are all the, the the specs that we have included that it will include microwave kitchen toilet everything that is needed to run it even with the solars included and it will have a basic simple finish like this but if you want to go up more higher end we can do that but it's just it will cost more but the pricing is awesome guys because imagine this what if you get an fmtv and you want to finish the truck yourself and you're on a very tight budget you can buy one from me for twenty five thirty thousand dollars that needs some work but then you want to put your camper shell in the back say if you want the 16 foot camper with a single axle if you get that um these campers are around 28,000 bucks. So, and that's the installation included. So with shipping, we'll say, uh, with your truck and with the camper. Um, so say it's an even 30,000 with this truck and another earth, even 30,000 with the camper. You're spending only $60,000 guys on a expedition truck. That's incredible. That's a really good deal. Now, if you make it more high-end, you upgrade the truck, we finish the interior, make it really nice, and we add on a lot more higher-end in exterior, interior and exterior finishes, and even add more solar and batteries, we could get you more premium finish and still only get to about $100,000 on the truck. That's really good, because on this website, if you go back here, there is trucks like this guy right here, I got a quote, where it's basically well over 
uh, I think it was three hundred to four hundred thousand dollars for that truck. So, in the long run, you're saving a lot of money when you're getting these simple uh, shells that we purchase from overseas. These come out of Australia and Asia, and then we are basically my team will make sure we properly mount it and get it attached to your truck and retrofit your truck as well. So there's a lot of great advantages to this. Um, again, we are working on doing the fiberglass shell, but when I've done my research for the past two months, all in all composite framing actually has ended up being very affordable and uh, the manufacturers that do it make it for a really reasonable price that I really highly recommend to you have you look into just getting a composite camper shell attached and then uh, you can still go camping and have something extremely affordable. Now if you go for a bigger trucks like the, um, uh, the MTVR or if you get the other ones that we have available uh, or we could get available, you can get o could go over $100,000 but still again guys, are you want to spend half a million dollars on an expedition truck or you only want to spend around $100,000? it's it's a really good deal so um so i can i can go bigger i can make modification but it's just going to cost me a little bit more but we can make it happen but uh this is officially ready to go we are we officially have our vendors ready um i can change colors on these if needed we can make them gray uh it just depends on what you want and then also the last thing i forgot to tell you if you go for 20 feet it's not that much more. It's about $6,000 more if you go for a 20-foot shell. Uh, so we've got to go for 16, 20-foot. And if I do got to go a little bit more custom like this one, we can. It just depends on what you want to do. So I hope this excites you guys. I'm just as excited as you. I'm still pushing to do a fiberglass shell because the market's there. There's a lot of co uh, companies that like Earth Roamers and a couple others that have these amazing shells with smooth curves and more aerodynamic and also lightweight and also these are pretty lightweight with the foam insulated walls but still um it's a pretty big deal with the uh with the fiberglass to me so it, it's just going to take me a little bit longer to get that set up but for now let's uh we're offering this to you today um i am not sure about discounts yet i'm creating this video this morning because i got to go to a big appointment but i will announce to my subscribers in the email uh if i do decide to do a discount in the first set of orders on this but again thank you so much um things just keep getting better and better we keep finding more things that can make our campers more affordable and ready to go off-roading and if you do have any questions please let me know thank you Bye bye